It seems we're not yet done with the release of new large language models as Lighton just announced the release of their insane new LLM called Alfred 40B-0723. This comes with some all new features that will blow your mind. Come with me on this journey as we explore this new AI. Well, Alfred 40B isn't exactly all new in the sense that you would expect. The model is built on the foundations of Falcon 40B, which is an LLM from the same company. So what we basically have with Alfred 40B is a model that addresses the shortcomings of the older Falcon 40B. For any new LLM entering the AI space now, there have to be some distinctive features that will set you apart from others if you really want to be recognized in the face of models from OpenAI, Google, and Microsoft. And this is exactly what LightOn has done with this model. Alfred 40B comes with some new, exciting features like prompt engineering, no-code application development, and Falcon RLHF. Prompt engineering is a technique that allows users to construct and evaluate effective prompts tailored to their specific needs. The usefulness of well-tailored prompts can't be overemphasized in these large language models. It goes a long way to determine how the machine will respond to queries. A prompt is a piece of text that provides instructions to the language model on what to generate. The better the prompt, the better the output of the language model. This is why the prompt engineering feature in Alfred 40B is designed to make it easier for users to create effective prompts. It does this by providing a variety of tools and resources to help users understand how prompts work and to experiment with different types of prompts. So how exactly does this LLM fulfill this role for the user? First is that the LLM is capable of generating suggestions for prompts for the user. Based on the user's input, this feature can generate suggestions for prompts, ensuring that the user gets the best response for the query. This can be helpful for users who are not sure how to start. And since so much is dependent on the prompts generated, this LLM evaluates the quality of prompts. The feature can evaluate the quality of prompts based on a variety of criteria. This can help users to improve their prompts and get better results. Explaining the meaning of prompts to help the user with a better understanding of the technicalities behind prompt generation is another feature. The feature can explain the meaning of prompts in natural language. This can be helpful for users who are not familiar with the technical details of prompt engineering. The prompt engineering feature is a powerful tool that can help users to get the most out of Alfred 40B. It's a valuable resource for anyone who wants to use language models to generate creative and informative content. And in case you're wondering, this feature has some really practical applications. For instance, a marketing manager could use the feature to generate a good ad copy that is tailored to a specific target audience without much stress. And in a similar fashion, since the use of LLMs is becoming widespread, it could aid a student or teacher to create personalized learning materials for personal use or for students respectively. The possibilities are endless. The prompt engineering feature is a powerful tool that can be used to improve the performance of language models in a variety of applications. If there's one thing that the new AI models are doing effectively, it's breaching the gap between professionals and those without technical knowledge. This means that people are able to do more than they normally would have done with the help of machines. In line with this, Alfred 40B includes an insane feature that helps users create and run applications without any foundational knowledge of that field. This feature is called No-Code Application Development. The no-code application development is a functionality that enables users to create applications without coding expertise. Very much similar to what you can do with Google Bard in terms of code generation, this time-saving feature is targeted at accelerating development and optimizing workflow efficiency. The no-code application development feature functionality is very simple to access, just like any other feature in the natural language model. Alfred 40B allows users to create applications without any need for coding expertise and this is done by providing a graphical user interface that allows users to drag and drop elements to create their applications. The no-code application development feature is powered by Alfred 40B's ability to understand natural language. 
This allows users to create applications by simply describing what they want the application to do. For example, a user could create an application that generates a to-do list by simply typing create a to-do list application. The no-code application development feature is a powerful tool that can be used to create a variety of applications for some minor tasks. So instead of seeking out coding professionals for very minor tasks, you can easily use Alfred 40B to create to-do list applications, which are applications that can be used to track tasks and deadlines or create note-taking applications which can be used to take notes and organize ideas. You can also make your personal assistant applications using this AI model. Such applications can be used to set reminders, make appointments, and control smart devices. The applications that can be used in business management to ensure efficiency can also be made with this. This is good news for any business that requires the efficiency that comes with computing but can't really afford the services of a professional coder. These applications can be used to manage inventory, track sales, and automate tasks. The possibilities are just endless with these AI models and we're definitely seeing more innovations in the coming days. The no-code application development feature is a powerful tool that can be used to create applications that meet the needs of businesses and individuals. Generally, the notion and idea surrounding AI is to make it easy for users to access computing resources without much stress. This has basically been the goal since the evolution of programming language. It just gets simpler by the day. That's why people with no coding experience can create applications with the help of the Alfred 40B GUI. The added advantage here is that it's fast, meaning that applications can be created quickly and easily. And the flexibility that comes with the application makes it a lot easier to use. One other added advantage to the Alfred 40B is the training method that was used in the making of the model. They made use of reinforcement learning from human feedback, or RLHF, in training the model. The foundation of Falcon 40B is the generative AI copilot that powers Alfred 40B. It's a significant advancement in the field, leveraging reinforcement learning from human feedback to train Alfred 40B on a mix of public data sets and highly curated data annotated by LightOn's dedicated team. This means that AI has the potential to grow over time from interaction with people, just as is common with some other AI models. These mentioned capabilities are not just the only things that Alfred 40B is capable of. They are the extra baggage added to the regular capabilities that you'll find on any large language model out there. This means that the model is capable of translation, text generation, answering questions on different subjects, and so on. So let's say that the new features are just a little extra something that will distinguish the product from the numerous other products that are available in the market, which is very necessary if any headway is to be made. Both Falcon 40B and Alfred 40B are large language models, or LLMs, developed by LightOn. However, there are some key differences between the two models, with Alfred 40B being ahead of its predecessor Falcon 40B. In terms of training data, Falcon 40B is trained on a massive dataset of text and code, while Alfred 40B is fine-tuned on a mix of public datasets and highly curated data annotated by LightOn's team. That gives it more access to data it can work with. This automatically means that Alfred 40B is better at generating text that is relevant to specific tasks and domains, thereby satisfying the demands of users as much as possible. Now, when it comes to fine-tuning AI models, methods such as supervised learning are so much more demanding and expensive to run, and some personal bias from human trainers is likely to surface in the system. The Falcon 40B is fine-tuned using traditional methods, such as supervised learning. But on the other hand, Alfred 40B is fine-tuned using reinforcement learning from human feedback, which allows it to learn from human feedback and improve its performance over time. That gives the machine more control in picking data based on the instruction it has. With this, although still not totally efficient, the machine will be able to avoid some of the bias and be able to make decisions based on the facts that it has. Hopefully, this feature will become a lot more efficient in the coming months. Also, Alfred 40B has shown to be more efficient than Falcon 40B in terms of performance. It has been shown to outperform Falcon 40B on a number of tasks, such as text generation, translation, and question answering. 
And since AI grows exponentially, I'm really looking forward to what this model will grow to be in the near future. Overall, Alfred 40B is a more powerful and versatile LLM than Falcon 40B. It's better at generating text that's relevant to specific tasks and domains, and it's able to learn and improve its performance over time. And Light On has made the program open source. In the coming days, we'll hope to be seeing some optimizations on this model and many others. And for other companies, I think they're now focusing more on making what they have to perform better instead of putting out new models. Whatever the case, be sure to get updated on the latest trends and updates from this channel. That'll be all for this video and we'll see you in the next one.